Hello everybody and welcome back to EKG. My name is Paul. I'm neither of the people in those intro videos, but if you've been watching with us, I think you've caught up with that part by now. But if it's your first time joining us on this series, welcome. Uh, I'm just kind of, this is kind of like our chill vibes Animal Crossing playthrough. So I'm just kind of going around showing people my town. I usually, this is usually about a week in between each recording, uh, or at least, you know, per week. So usually stuff in my town has changed significantly by the time each, each time we record. Uh, I was going to show everyone the art museum expansion last uh, couple episodes ago, and then I completely forgot. I got sidetracked, even though I said I was going to come in here. So we're going to explore it now. I have three pieces of genuine artwork so far. This is the only statue I have. It is uh, Discobolus, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Apparently, uh, second century CE. Um, these are all based on real pieces of art, so if you don't recognize it, these are, these are real. I mean, this one you probably will recognize. This is the Starry Night Van Gogh. So, and they've got, like, cool facts on each uh, piece of art as well. Because this is the Ophelia one, like, the, the Hamlet one. So they got some cool stuff in here as well. I think those are the only three I have, but I can tell this is going to be, like, a really cool expansion to the museum here. Like, even when you go in here, like, these must be some giant paintings, because it, like, zooms back, and you can, like, sit in front of them. Pretty neat. Pretty cool how they just added this on, like, as free DLC. I mean, I assume it's meant to always be part of the game. Maybe they just didn't get it done in time. But either way, still very cool. So continuing our, our little nighttime trip across Isle Isle here. I feel like I either record this series at literally 8 a.m., like crack of dawn for me, or 1 a.m. <laughs> it's one or the other. We're never going to record this midday, I feel like. I don't think that's ever going to happen. What haven't we seen in a while? Let's take a little stroll through Isle Isle. I, I have, uh, I don't know if you guys saw Fuchsia yet. I do like Fuchsia. We can go see, uh, see what her house looks like. I think we saw her house maybe when she wasn't moved in yet, but she might be crafting right now. Let's go find out. I kind of made her like a, kinda like a spa outside. I, I don't know if I'm going to keep it or not. I, it's kind of just the start of things. It's what I had furniture for. Um, but I don't know. I, I haven't got a chance to ask her what kind of shop she wants to run. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting that uh, Eric lives in our town and he hasn't been on this series yet. I, feel, I keep saying I'm going to get him on the series, but I don't know if it's going to happen. His timing just hasn't worked out yet. Listen, I'll make a pledge right here. We're going to get him on the series before the, before I stop playing Animal Crossing. Even, even if it has to go to, for a, to 100 episodes before that happens, I'll make it happen. I'm going to go say to hi to Phoebe now. Phoebe's house is awesome, as you, you guys have seen if you've been watching this series. I keep trying to give her outdoor stuff that'll vibe with her house. So far, I've done okay. Or I'll either give her outdoor stuff or, like, fire-based stuff. Oh, that's cool. They know it's raining even when... Okay, see, this is exactly what I talk talked about last episode. If they offer to buy fish off you, do not give it to them. Because if I give her the sea bass, she will put it on display, front and center in her house. Like, it's the f prized catch of a fish. And I'm not letting that happen. No more. I, I got rid of Jacob purely because he had a giant sea bass always on display in his house. And I could not forgive him. Even though it's my fault. He died for my sins. <laughs> Alright. I have not caught your wharf roach yet. Are we going to get Astrid's wharf roach? I don't think so. I have to go check out these rocks and see if there is one. I just don't think that's going to happen, Astrid. I'm so sorry. I have a violin and a cello now. I like the violin a little better, I think. Although they sound good together if you can get like a whole band together here. This music shuffles in the cafe. Right now I'm not liking what's playing. <laughs> that was very loud. Alright. Flick, I still hate you, bud. I don't know why you had to be here right now. Alright. So the flowers have been watered, the fossils have been picked. I could make some money right now. I, I still haven't ca caught that coal can that I said I was going to catch. A bunch of the sea turtles are out in full force right now, too. So we can check the rivers, or, uh... I'm gonna, I'm gonna check the oceans, just in case I get a chance at that wharf roach that Astrid wants. Because Astrid kind of seems like she'll kill me if I don't <laughs> get her that wharf roach. She's very intimidating. Be a zebra, be a zebra. Ah, I'll take a spit, I guess. I mean, I won't take it happily, but... I'm not gonna throw it back. Ooh, that could be a good one. Alright, quiet on set. Come on, come on, don't 
be a sea bass. Anything but a sea bass. It's a sea bass. Ah, uh, so is my life. My life is a sea bass. C plus, I'll take it though. Above average. All right. This is gonna be a zebrafish. I know it. It's not a squid. Whatever it is, it's not a squid. Yup, called it. I'll take that barred knife jaw. Probably like the one of the the biggest, uh, the most expensive like non-big fish you can get. I'll take that back. The barrel eye is worth 20k, but ooh, that's gonna be a good one. It didn't look at that. Didn't look at that either. This is gonna be another uh, zebrafish, I think. It's another barred knife jaw. Oh, it's a squid. This time I tricked myself out. That's what I get. Because when it's raining, technically you do get better fish. And the music changes, so it's almost worth it for that. You get like these like bongo drums in the background of any like music that plays. Come on, don't be a sea bass. Oh, sea bass are out in full force tonight. Very sorry about that. One of these days I'm going to have, I'm just going to open up the dodo code. Let you guys all come visit Isle Isle. We'll have to find a day that works for that. I'd like to find a day where I'm just kind of off work all day. Where I can just leave the island open. You guys can just kind of pop in. Say hello. Tour the island. Stroll around. Do some fishing. I think that'd be kind of cool after everyone's, uh, you know, watched me play this for a few episodes. So, if, I mean, if you've been, you know, watching, commenting, you know, keeping up with the series, definitely let me know in the comments if you uh, are interested in that town visit. Uh, I'm on Twitter at uh, Big Small Paul on Twitter, so you can. If I post the dodo code, I'll probably end up posting it there. So again, that's uh, at Big Small Paul on Twitter. Usually, I'll follow you back if you uh, engage with me on there. So feel free to give me a follow. I'll give you a follow back. Mostly, I'll post comic book shit and re retweet my comic book podcast, but. Lately, it's been all Animal Crossing posts, so if you like Animal Crossing, I'll have your shit covered there. Other than the one barred knife jaw, I haven't really gotten much. Eric's house is still off limits until he's on the episode. I'm not going to spoil the fun of his house. I want him to give the tour. Maybe I'll make that happen for, for next week's episodes. We'll see. I think if it's going to happen, it'll happen next week. Don't hold me to that, but keep an eye out. Annabelle, I need you to root for me. Root for me, Annabelle. Yup. Come on, clap for me. Clap for me, Annabelle. Oh, she walked right by. That's some shade. That's some shade. Annabelle, did you not see my red snapper? Did you not see it? I'm sorry, I can't stay mad at you. She is not reacting. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> I love when they do that. <laughs> it's hilarious when they do the shocked animation right next to you. They're like, oh my god, what? <laughs> uh, still no Wharf Roach. I don't think I'm going to get Astrid's gift. I'm very sorry, Astrid. Ooh. Did I scare it? Did I scare it? Ooh, nice. Give me a coal canth. All I want is that coal canth. Another sea bass. Count them, folks. This episode is called the Sea Bass Drinking Game. Pour them out. <laughs> I think we're already, what, how many shots would be would be in? You'd be one, two, three, four, five shots in already. Oh, boy. It's barely been ten minutes. I'm very sorry if you decided to do the sea bass drinking game. But you know what? We're not done yet. I'm very sorry. <laughs> I'm going to have to put you in the dirt here. Did I scare that fish away? Oh, I did. That was a mistake. Sorry, Hermit Crab. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Folks playing the sea bass drinking game. Be careful. This might be another one. Although it didn't look at that. That's promising. Oh, there it goes. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Get your shots poured. That's another one. Pour them out. <laughs> oh, I, I can't be held responsible if you decided to play that game. I don't advise it. I don't advise it. Oh, no. Nope, that's not what I meant to do. Damn it. I accidentally brought out my wand. It's not what I wanted. Alright, you know what? Since I brought out the wand, we're doing it. Fancy orgy. 
<laughs> it's my fancy orgy costume. Animal mask, tuxedo, no pants. Let's do this. Ooh, it sounds different when you're barefoot. I like that. These fish are going to come out in full force for the fancy orgy. Let's do this. Oh, that's a fuck up. Come on, come on. Yup, that's two barred knife jaws in one episode. I will take that. I'm going to hold on to these till tomorrow. Let's fill up our inventory and then uh, we'll take that to Nooks in the morning. All right, I think we got at least one fish in, our, in us left. Let's get one more fishy. Where's it going to be? We're going to get one off the pier? Sorry, Hermit Crab, not interested. I think the Hermit Crab would be happier if I wasn't interested now that I think about it. He doesn't want to be caught and sold to the Nooks. <gasps> the Wharf Roach! Oh, I can't fuck this up. Yes! You know what, that's how we're going to close the episode. We're going to give uh, Astra what she wants so I don't get killed. So she doesn't send the Joey after me. That would be very bad. Oh, I like the sound of the barefoot on the on the wet stone pathway here. It's the splish splash. Some ASMR. <laughs> oh, thank God she's awake. I was worried she'd go to bed before I could give this to her. Although, like I said, the sisterly villagers um, are usually awake till like 3.30, so they're the ones up the latest. Gotta love them. Oh, no, actually, uh, Astrid's not sisterly. She's snooty, so actually I'm really glad she's awake. Let me get up. Would you get up? Get up already. No. Oh, my God, this is bullshit. No, get up. Thank you. Don't you sit that down. I brought you a bug, and if you put it on display, you are getting kicked out of this town. I'm telling you right now, if you put this wharf roach on display, you're gonna regret it. Astrid, you just joined, but I'm not afraid to enforce the rules. Oh wait, what'd she give me? Electronics kit? I have it, but I'll take it. I appreciate it. It's the thought that counts. Oh, she's happy. The Joey's happy. We're all happy. Oh, look, she <laughs> she's embarrassed. Astrid's growing on me. Her house is weird, but it's something. Goodbye, Astrid. And goodbye all of you. And join us next time for more Animal Crossing.